Hello everybody. My name is Jeff. <laughs> All right. Hello everybody. This is Michael here, and welcome back to my Telltale the Wolf Among Us episode three, part two. So we had some Tweedle problem, and you know we don't like the Tweedle problem. We found we were told Snow White and the rest of the gang about the crane, and then the Tweedle problem happened, and then. Holly got shot, and then Granny Ninja got shot, and let's go. Double for the double. I keep forgetting that it's continuous. It's not. That's that one. Now we gotta see if they die or not. And if they be determined or not. Because basically I'm... Episode 3, a crooked mile. Every single time I'm doing bad. The mirror is dead. Look at my body. So sexy. I did as well as I could to take out the buckshot, but there's still some shards left embedded in your shoulder. They'll eventually warm their way out on their own, but until they do, you're shards? Be sore. Big B, Dr. Swinehart was appointed for Swinehart. Oh, okay, Swinehart. It's okay. There's only one thing you have to take away from all this. Take it Look easy. Look at my hair. My chest hair. <laughs> <laughs> Don't go looking for any more fights. Keep strain off your heart. Everyone else. And try and get some rest. How's everyone else? They all make it. They're fine. Okay, good. I had everyone that got wounded sent home. Holly refused to let me see where she lived, so I left her and Grendel back at her bar with a dose of juniper and spring juniper. water. No, yet yeah, I'm sick of the Titans, Big B. They'll be fine. Just remember what I said: the stitches won't hold up if you continue to act like you normally. Okay. Everything in moderation. And uh, eat more chicken. Your blood pressure's through the proverbial roof. Look, I'm not the one who creates the situations. I'm just the one who has to deal with them. So you say. Okay. Swan hat. Reinhardt. Business office. I know. I'll have to call you back. What happened? The town is starting to find out. Well, I'll leave you two to it. Okay. Swan hat. Do you like you uncomfortable my my sex and body? Yeah, yeah, bunny. You so, like my body? I Kane sexy. watched me through the magic mirror, uncover his room at the open arms, and then he smashed it so we couldn't use it ourselves to go after. Oh, okay. And we know this because Buffkin was drinking in the rafters. Not about covering. Oh right. Once he puts all the pieces back together, it'll be easy to catch. You dead? Him. If it pieces aren't so, I. Guess that's the plan currently. But I, Any I don't leads? know. There's no other leads. This is it. Just wait for the. What if, took, what if he took one of yeah. the pieces out? Like, like in a wizard way place. Going on. Just, I don't know what the Tweedles get out of this. That I don't know if Crane sent them. I don't know if. I mean, this is gonna sound crazy, but do you really? Unless think someone Crane else will have. Everything say, points I... to him. I get it, but. Do you really think he killed those women? Because it's uh, just... I'm did he kill you, mate? To be honest. I don't know. It just doesn't make sense. But he's not glamorous. He's, he was a conniver. A, a coward. A guy who a got killed by a pumpkin. And I'll always hate him for that. And I'll hate him for how he held me in his thoughts. But murdering prostitutes? Ow. Everything okay you need gloves? over there? Yes, Miss White. I just cut myself on a piece of the glass. You Nothing need you gloves. About. I should offer you gloves. Yeah. Thanks for tonight, by the way. That could have gone really terribly. I mean, even worse the than Tweedles it did. The Tweedles got away. I just can't fucking stand that they got away. We'll catch up to them, Bigby. Now Bigby we know that the bad guys, I should have hurt him more instead of treating him like a house guest. Can I, um, ask you Yes, I'm single. I love you. It's kind of personal. My body. And... 
I don't want to offend you, but after tonight, it's on What's my on mind. your mind? Why? What's on your mind? It's just, when stuff hits the fan, like, like it did tonight, it feels like before we came to the city, it feels kind of like home. Okay. And I've heard it said that maybe in some tiny little bottled up way, deep inside, you kind of enjoy it. Yeah, I'm the sheriff. When things go wrong. Because it gives you an excuse to just, you know, stop so pretending. What so what if I do? You think we're broken or something? Is that it? I don't know. Maybe we're just not cut out for this world. Then how do we go back? We can't eat each other's hearts anymore, Bucky. <laughs> this can't be like the old days. We have to make it better. Uh, it what happened? It's missing a piece. We have missing a, a piece. What is it? I can't finish the mirror. I knew it's it. Missing a piece. I knew it. What do you mean, missing a piece? Yes, it's uh. It's not Crane like must have taken. Crane I knew it. A shard with him. Oh, I can't believe this. I saw Crane pick something up after he smashed it. I'm sorry, I didn't realize what it was until now. Well, the mirror can't work unless it's whole. Well, that's not entirely true. Or what, Buffkin? What? We sit around and wait until it mends itself? We have but no the, idea what how the long that What the genie? You're just a genie in this? I'm just gonna have to do this the hard way. I'm just saying, waiting is an option. No. We can't depend on the mirror. How long will the mirror, mirror take? Alright. How long will it take for the mirror to reform? Well, it could take days. Or months, or years. Oh. He had to have left something that tells us where he's going. He's a neat freak, but he was never that smart. Dumb smart man. to take a piece of uh -huh. mirror. We can still solve this ourselves. I know Never that. mind that. Come help me look. What if Buffkin's that guy? I'm just kidding. Oh, no. He seemed like one of the Wizard of Oz monkeys, so he could be. Buffkin, let's talk to him. Monkey. Hi, Mr. Bigby. I can still help you catch Crane, you know. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. Yes. I saw him jump on the telephone before he left. He called up somebody. He said he needed to see his witch, or that he would need to get to the witch for that. Whoever that A is. A witch? His witch? Yes, it sounded like the one he got his snow glamours from. Okay. Hmm. Why didn't you stop him? Why didn't you try and stop him? What do you want me to do, yank on his hair? I'm only three feet tall. What hair? Here. Okay, okay. See anything else? You didn't see anything else, did you? No, not, uh, not especially. especially. It's not your fault. Look, uh, the whole mirror thing, it's not your fault, all right? Y you mean it? Yes. Yeah. It's not your fault. I know that. I'll just it's see not your if fault. I can do anything about this. You do that. It's not your fault. I know that. It's not your fault. <laughs> oh, why? <laughs> Crane's desk. We had to look at that weasel's desk. I had to walk around. Director of Operations. Look at the letter. Are there any reason updates on the extra funding I requested? As I explained in my last letter, the conditions here could do with some improvement. I'm seeing some unrest from the residents. And I have to admit, I can see why. This farm should not be a punishment. I'm sure you busy, but I think this should be made a priority. Vast Wayland Smith. Look at that. Sad eye. Uh... Next letter. Hello, I'm writing this to ask you again that you please send someone to fix the air conditioning in our unit. It's burning up in the apartment and Pinocchio says the skin is splintering. Oh my god, Pinocchio. I don't know what that means, but I assume it's something gross and I really like it if you fix the air like we asked you three months ago. At the very least, provide us a fan in the meantime. Oh my god, it's so mean. Boy blue. He's not doing it right. You said, you said you'd have to have the plaster redone in my building after the la last incident in 204. It's falling off the fucking walls. Uh, please fix it. If I can't rest out that room as it is 
and I've already been waiting for days. Not to mention, you already promised me you'd send someone to fix the big crack in the glass on the front door. Well, guess what? It's your worst now. Get your shit together, Mr. Toad. Did Crane ever do any work? Only when Cole... Cole, Cole. Hidden box. <gasps> the key. What is it? It's the key to his room at the open arms. You still haven't told me what was in there. I want to know. Crane's fantasy. I need to know. Crane was, uh, paying Lily to live out a fantasy. Of him and you, together. Forgive me if I spare you the details. I keep thinking back. I keep replaying moments in my head. Interactions with him when he'd catch me in the elevator or bump into me outside. He's on purpose. It's all. There's only so according much to plan. Press, you know. No regrets. What else is there? What else is there? No regrets. Come on, let's keep looking. Okay, door is lasting there. It's locked. Break it open. Break it open. Okay. I'm happy. I got this. Let's look at what's in here. Let's see if there's the evil plan is in this. Witching cloak. Okay. There's a page here that was torn out. Oh yeah? Buffkin, do you know what was here? Hello, Buffkin. It's a ring, at least. Every magical item not retained in the armory is assigned to someone in Fable Town. It must be this witch he is going oh, to see. Okay. Wait, what witch? Buffkin overheard Crane set up a meeting with a witch. Well, yes, it sounded like the one he got his, uh, you glamours from. And the hair. It must be about this ring. The one ring. Why not mention this before? No one asked me. Buffkin. Uh. And I'm hungover. I'm sorry. You should not drink then. He set the meeting at 2 a.m. Tonight. Tonight. What's going on? Is the mirror fixed yet? Bluebeard, this isn't the time. Is the mirror fixed or isn't it? You called I me called to... just to see if you knew where Crane could be. And that was it, okay? And I'm sorry I said anything more than that. Well, you did, and I know. Okay. The cat's out of the bag. So, can we find the dull pervert or not? The mirror can't be fixed. No, it can't be fixed. It's missing a piece. This is none of Bluebeard's business, Bigby. None of my business? Crane's the murderer. He escaped. It seems he spoiled your every attempt at locating him. And now it's none of my business? Okay. We don't know if he's the murderer. Oh, please. Of course he is. Look, this just isn't the time. He took a piece of the mirror so we can't use it. The only thing we know is that Crane's going to see a witch at 2 o'clock. Are you telling him what's up? A.M. or P.M.? A.M. or P.M.? A.M. Listen, Bluebeard, you're not a part of this. I don't think you're in any position to turn away. What do you know about Crane? Define help. What do you know about Crane, anyway? That he has the stones to kill prostitutes like any common sex-frightened serial killer and not face a real challenge. Look. Okay, oh yeah, he's Crane a killer. Is going to see a witch, and it's to acquire a magic ring. What's the, the ring? The one ring. I don't know what it does or who it's assigned Drew to since Crane tore its page out of the book. This farce was your ridiculous farce. idea for a plan. I mean, who put you in charge in the first place? Fixing the mirror was the most logical You're thing. You're a secretary. He's a sheriff. And none of you were chosen to run this office. Who elected you to make these decisions? No, yeah. Who doesn't... elected her to spend my money? Well, I've been doing that unofficially for years now. Unofficially I'm is not officially. I'm heading up the investigation, okay, Bluebeard? That makes this a moot point. And somebody needs to run the business office while he does so. Well then, excuse me for having the cover. This is his money. He rich man. <sighs> All right, let's just look on the bright side. We know Crane is going to see the witch that's been supplying him black market glamours. Thanks. To okay. Me. And that he'll be there. So it'll too. be a surprise to me so if I didn't talk to him first. Us a few short hours to find out who it is and where they live and get them all at once. And a few shorter hours, the more you babble about. Well, we haven't been the ones babbling. Yeah, yeah. 
Just point in the direction you want me to check first. Since Lily used the glamours, she'd have known who the witch was. And I don't think Holly's burned her things yet. It would probably have the address or a phone number or something. And Bigby is free to go there if he likes. But I think the question you okay. should be asking is just Can what do the two Tweedles know about this? It doesn't matter what they what know. What does the tonight, they huntsman never go to do? Office. The woodsman do? They're not smart enough to try and go anywhere else. The trip trap is the better option to track the witch down. That has to be the our focus. Office Even awesome. if they're not there, the Tweedles office might have something on Crane. Or the witch. I don't really care what you two do. I'm going to his apartment. What? You can't just go up there. And why the hell not? We already looked for the key, remember? I don't know where it is. Then what I'll take the blasted lock. <sighs> I've wasted enough time waiting for the mirror to find him. I won't waste any more. You just can't go up there alone, all right? I've no interest in nicking his What is his voice? If that's what concerns you. What concerns me is you traipsing through possible evidence. Oh, now it's evidence. Before okay. you had Fine. no interest, in, and now it's a crime scene. Fine, I don't care. Just go ahead. We can't just let Bluebeard run a mock in Crane's place. Ah! He's after something. I just don't know what it is. We have to find the witch, Bluebeard, since that's where he's going. Or the sniveling weasel chickened out. Never went anywhere, and is upstairs right now in his pitiful penthouse, crafting a full of couch cushions. <laughs> Look, this is how a smart person would do it. So this is how we're going. I have to do it. a choice. Wherever you go, I'll go to the other. I don't like you going anywhere unsupervised. He's up to something. I don't know what it is, but uh, we don't have the time to really worry about it. Opposite now. choice. He'll go the other way. Where are you gonna go, baby? Okay choices. Now I'll look out in the distance, have two things on my side. Find the witch. Oh. So you leave Crane alone, and we leave you alone. I'd love to join you, but there's some business I need to attend okay. to. No, no, I'm better off dealing with things alone. I don't need sympathy in a Okay. Way. Okay. I did say D's office, so... D and Dumb must know where he is. I should go to their office first. Perfect. And I'll go to Crane's apartment. I'll look up their address. I hope you know what you're doing. Okay, let's go. What big eyes you have. Alright, let's just continue this. Who are you? <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, hi. Sheriff Bigby. Great, great to see you. I don't know if you remember me. I've, uh, seen you around, but you may have forgotten. I know who you are, Flycatcher. You, you've worked at the Woodlands for how many years now? <laughs> I think I've lost Flycatcher, he's a frog? But you know, Crane, uh, let me go. Oh, that basically. sucks. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I mean, it's no big deal. Well, your eyes. So, they better not be on the top of your head. brings you here? I mean, can I help you with anything? Are you here to see one of the brothers? D or uh, Dumb? They, they aren't, they're in here right now. I'm not okay, sure I've seen a witch. Back. Have you seen a witch come by? Um, I don't know. Sometimes. Really? But who is she? Do you know where she lives? Uh, I don't know her name or where she lives, really. She just sometimes drops stuff off for the brothers to deliver. Deliver to who? I've never had any reason to see for myself. Okay, so, and more information from me now? It's been uh, a quiet night so far. I think the twins are out, probably working on a case. Sometimes I don't. So if I went to Crane's apartment, they gave me the job after Crane told me to get lost. Oh, he said I was just in the way. Off. Why don't you take the night off? That's nice of you, but I, I can't. I still have to no, leave this. I can let you in if you want. You can wait. For okay. Me. Sure. Thanks. No problem. I'm gonna have to take a look around. Uh, well, I, I guess that would be All right. okay. I wasn't really asking for. Permission. I don't want. Right, you're the sheriff. I just don't. Are want you to like try. Ben or something? I'm sure it's fine. I mean, they never told me not to. Don't get you in trouble. Don't worry, I won't get you in trouble. Right. Right. Salmon inbox. 
Dear brother, I hate dog. dogs. I hate <laughs> dogs, and you know it. Sincerely, brother D. What's that about? They do have their quirks. What if I went to the cranes? Then uh, where would where would uh, Bluebeard go? Don't touch. Oh, touch. Dear brother D, I think we should get ourselves. Oh, okay. Back. Sincerely, brother Dumb. Couple of they just send each other letters when they're right near each other. <sighs> this is pointless. Now, I, I know these guys can come off abrasive at times. Abrasive. They aren't so bad once edge. you know them. The abrasive sponge. And they really care about helping people. They're kind of loud at times, but you get used to it. How do you mean? I guess they have to be in their line of work. How do you mean they help people? They're detectives. Anyone can come in here with a problem and they'll do their best to fix it. The way D explains it, it's like if someone lost their cat, well, they could hire them to, you know, track it down. Or like sometimes they get packages for people. Uh, they can be like couriers, you know? You mean for people other than the witch? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. It. Come to think of it, I, see I your don't eyes. really know where they keep them. Anyways, I'm just saying, you just don't know them like I do. Sure. Okay. Let's see what's in that cigar box. A key. You know about this? Uh, no. Okay, file cabinet. Let's see if they've got a file on a A to D. Let's see the D. Beauty. Okay. This is worse than that. Has an interest. Words, Clementine, fine. Ooh, donkey skin. Set a total from Crane. I find it all called easy job. Well, Crane hired them to look for a photo. Warrants. So that's why they were at her apartment. And the woods place. Okay. That photo. See, I knew you wouldn't find anything. And it is of interest. Anyways, they're detectives, like I I'm said. Finding I'm finding enough. I'm just saying. Look, just trust me on this. Tweedledee and Dumb are not nice. They're I not helping nice. anyone. Well, they helped me. Okay, great, they helped you. That's one person. Now, please, just let me concentrate here. Oh, Zap Brannigan. Zap Brannigan. Brannigan. Oh, okay. oh yeah. Brannigan. Keep an eye on her. Keep an eye on her. Cinderella. Have you met Cinderella yet? Let's see. Is it is it the girl? Is it that, the girl that was outside? Is, is it? No, someone else. Where has she been? She's not here. She's missing. Okay, now let's go see Crane. Ichabod. Crane. Ichabod. He owes the crooked man money. Well, who's the crooked man? Shit. How was he planning to pay this well, all back? Request for property acquisition. Donkey skin. For the details filed under donkey skin. Why did he want it back so We don't know. Find anything? Not what I need. W what, if, what if you're wrong about them? I'm not. They're misunderstood, sure, but that doesn't mean everything people say about them is true. I mean, you know, like when I think about it, you guys aren't. Don't say that about me. You help people, and they help people. Oh, yeah. Not that oh, it's car. business, but is that what you think? Bigby? Shit. There's something here. I know there is. There has to be. There has to be. Why would there be anything? Because to... they're lying to you. Okay, flycatcher. That's why. They, they shot at Snow White. They shot at Snow White. Bigby, what happened to your? <gasps> oh my god. You want to know what this is? This is them showing up to love okay, stress. with fucking shotguns. I, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I I, I, I didn't know. Yeah, Holly else. and Gren both got injured. Snow White nearly got her head blown off. Do you get it now? Okay, I'm, I, I'm sorry for being harsh on you. Oh my god. Three minutes, three minutes, three minutes, three minutes. Oh, okay, three minutes. Finish her, sir. <laughs> I didn't mean to. There's a door behind this file cabinet. Now, I don't know what they keep back here, but it might be what you're oh, looking okay. for. 
Well, that key you found should work. I, sh I should do an outro before like this ends. So let's see. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you like, subscribe, and leave a comment for any suggestions you have any. Alright, see you next time. Alright, okay. Let's see. Is this gonna have a new... A new unlock thingy? You better not lock me in. There's a plan here. Okay, he's, he's, he's just falls. Wow. Okay. Is he gonna die? I'm feeling he's gonna die. He, sh he showed me too much. Call Fefe. Call Fef. Oh my god, it's running out of time now. JD. We're running out of time. Come on, come on. Come on, Bominos. Bominos, please. Frog, man. What are you looking for exactly? Maybe I can help. Anything about Crane. Or the witch he was using. Something. This doesn't really tell us much. Okay, okay. okay. Alright, now bringing it back. Let's resume. Hopefully we can finish up. I got 16 minutes left now. So yeah. Filled it up. I can't even talk to you. Let's look at the scale. What is this? Drugs? Lots and lots of drugs? Oh my god. Crooked man. Crooked man? For your collection. Oh, what's that? What is that? No idea. Pretty sure it's something they aren't supposed to have. This isn't the witch. Oh, though. Right. Look at that package. Is that the witch's package? Hold for Hold BCW. BCW. Hmm. A mushroom. We got some shrooms in this place. Oh no, what do I do? What is this package? Butcher. Butcher. What is this stuff? Drugs, lots and lots of drugs. Let's look at the last package. Crooked man again. I'm sorry, I know I'm late. I'll get it to you soon. Okay, Crane. Crane. Who was he sending money to? Crooked man. Care of the lucky pawn. You know what that is? Let's take the money. He doesn't deserve that money. Is that what you needed? I don't think so. But it's interesting. There's more going on here. I still need to find My that witch. Red. Oh, it is us. As soon as possible. Hey, Bigby. Do you think, after all this, do you think I could come back to the woodlands? Since Crane let me go, I mean, okay. I can still work here. Works for me. I don't think I want to now. I don't want to work with bad people, you know? Well, Crane is gone now. Boy, okay. I can't see why he couldn't come back to the woodlands. Really? That would be... Thank you. Come oh, it's the like I should. Office. I can't make any promises. Right, of course. Oh, hair. It's Snow's hair. Snow White? Why... W we found her hair like this inside Lily's glamour. Auntie Green. Okay, now we have a name. This must be the witch Crane was using. I guess D and Dumb were getting the hair for Crane and sending it to her? That's not a pleasant thought. Oh, right. There's no address on it. So, so what now? Snow would probably want to know about yeah, this. Yeah, Snow needs to know about this. I should tell Snow about this. She might need to change her locks. Well, I can take care of that, if you want. Maybe she can find a record on this antique green leaf. I think I saw a phone near the back. 
Thanks. Okay. You better You're not... welcome, Sheriff. This is Sophus, this is Snow White. Hey, Snow. Oh, it's you. Sorry, I've been answering angry, angry phone, phone calls. calls. People want to know where Crane is. How'd it go with the Tweedle brothers? He no there. address yet, but I got a name for Crane's witch. Auntie Greenleaf. You heard of her? No. A Greenleaf. I'll get Buffkin started looking for a record, but it might take some time. Huh. Somebody's got to know where to find her. And Snow, I found a note with some money attached. Crane has been embezzling from Fable Town. Fable Town embezzlement. Of course, because why half-ass being a complete sleazeball? Do you think this is tied to the murders? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. Probably connected. I think it's connected. Maybe the girls found out about it? I don't know. Hmm, maybe. She's not gone angry. You might want to try Holly's place, see if she hasn't burned Lily's things yet. Or Crane's, you might find something there. Although, Bluebeard's been there. I'll leave it up to you, but we don't have much time. Crane is meeting her at 2 a.m. Um, I'll go to the trip trap. I'll go to the trip trap, see about Lily's things. I think that's our best option. Sounds good. Just, just be gentle with Holly when you get there, All right, okay? I've already torn my stitches. I'll give Buffkin the name and hope he finds something in the records. Let me know what he comes up with. Oh, okay. I'll be in touch. I hope you'll do the same. You don't need to pretend working not. anymore, Fly Catcher. Someone just came in. Good luck. <gasps> Someone just came in. Oh, okay. I think this video is long enough, so... Thank you guys for watching. I hope you like, subscribe, and leave a comment or any suggestions you have any. Alright. I'll see you guys next time.